Hello again, everybody. This is Mr. Everything, and I am coming back at you with another Wargaming and Miniature video. In this video, we're going to continue on with our What's in the Box series. And in the next few What's in the Boxes, maybe over the next couple of weeks, I'm going to be showing you a variety of the Italian Army options from Warlord Games. Um, I have started a commission for an Italian army, and so I'm going to take this opportunity to show off the various Italian options. And so you'll get a chance to, to see them before I actually paint them. When I'm done with the what's in the boxes uh, and I've finished the commission, uh, look for a video where I show them all painted. And in this first What's in the Box, we're going to look at the Italian Army support group. It's 10 metal figures from Warlord Games for their game Bolt Action. Uh, and it tells you like what genre they would be good for, early or mid. Uh, not so much the late is what they're saying. Okay, and this is what you should be getting. You should be getting uh, a light mortar, it looks like. Uh, it just, well, it says medium mortar team and a medium machine gun team. Uh, you should also get a radio operator, a medic, an officer with a pistol, and an officer with a submachine gun. Okay, well, that looks good. Let's go ahead and open this up and let's see what we get inside. All right, so now in the box, you're gonna get um, you're gonna get some bases for your individual figures. Uh, you're also gonna get a couple of bases for the mortar and the machine gun. This one just happened to be packed by Cherie. Pop this open and looks like we got a couple of bases here we got the Cherie packing slip now uh, they tighten up the little packages here by putting foam to keep the figures from rolling around uh, looks like a little flash no big deal you're gonna get that whenever you get any miniatures Okay, maybe one is machine gun and one is the mortar, but we'll worry about that in a moment. These are nice, solid, thick miniatures. Um, what we'll do, if you've never been to a What's in the Box, I kind of look over them real quick, and then I also zoom in so we can take a really good look. Okay, this guy looks like the medic. He's got a big bag on his hip. That's right, this is a support group. Officer with a pistol. Looks like maybe a mortar crewman. Yes, absolutely. officer with submachine gun, but he's also got a map in his hand. That's nice. We got a, let's see what we got here. Looks like a guy with an ammo box, maybe for the machine gun. Now, this looks like a sniper. That doesn't look like a machine gunner. Okay, on the machine gun, it's got a guy that looks like a sniper. Basically just an assistant crew member, that's nice. The radio man has this uh, radio with round antenna, that's cool. 
but it looks like I'm gonna have to figure out a way to get rid of that flash. Okay, it's a, it's gonna be fairly easy. It's gonna come right off. Another guy for the mortar. Okay, nice. A guy with mortar shells in a box. That's pretty cool. Looks like a guy kneeling behind a machine gun, ready to fire. And then, of course, a sprue for the mortar. Looks like it's got a base plate, a bipod, and the gun tube. But there's also an ammo box. That's nice. And then the machine gun's got a lot of flash on it. Uh, looks like two of the three legs and then one leg and it looks like it would lean over and then the machine gun would sit on top of it and it looks like another ammo can uh i don't think that's water can yeah that's ammo and then there's like a piece of a ammo belt right there um I'll have to figure out how all that goes together. And then a bunch of flash. Okay. Very nice. So, three, six, nine, ten figures, of course, as we already knew machine gun, mortar, officer, radioman, and medic. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and take a close-up look at these. All right, this is the guy that I said looked like a sniper. Well, he's got like an ammo box that he's shooting over. They got that distinct Italian helmet. And his canteen is like a long bottle. And then his legs have got those wraps. So yeah, he's definitely an Italian. He's not really a sniper. I don't see a scope or anything, but it was just the way he was laying down behind the box. Okay, officer with submachine gun. Binoculars, an, um, a map case. It's got he's got his map in the in his hands. You can see the folds of the map. Uh, no real extra equipment or anything. Sidearm, and he's got that weird soft cap you know, with the flat front of it. And of course, he's got his mustache. Okay. The other officer, the one with just the pistol, also that soft cap. Might have to do a little work on that pistol. I'm not exactly sure what that's supposed to look like. I think that's flash. I don't think that's a barrel. I'll have to see. Yeah, you can see his holster is open. He's got his knife right there in the front map case on his side cross straps okay wait a second yeah his boots are jack boots he doesn't have the wrap okay radio soft cap handset and earpiece 
canteen and just that just popped off nice shoulder straps for the radio one of the mortarmen is just leaning over straps ammo boxes right there tight on his front rifle slung a uh, little bit of mold line on his helmet but that can be that's going to be fixable super easy there's a lot of uh, mold release on these FYI here's the medic he's got that big bag in his hand holding his strap and the bag Okay, the machine gun gunner, he's kneeling. I don't see a whole lot of backpacks, I just see canteens. Right, detail on the bottom of his feet, okay. Guy laying next to the machine gun looks like that's a mat okay that's a belt okay it looks like they come on clips like short belts not like a flexible belt it looks rigid his rifle Another crewman, possibly the mortar. And then this is definitely the mortar crewman because he's got a box of mortar shells right there. Open box. Now, taking a look at the mortar tube bipod base plate and then there's an extra box of shells that's kind of a nice touch and then here is the machine gun with like a million pieces of flash off of it but that's okay we can look past that that's the actual machine gun and then these are this is the two legs of the tripod, and this is the third leg. This all needs to be glued together. You can see that the tripod, the base of the tripod is cut out. I'm gonna guess that that other piece fits right into that cutout. Um, and then there's an ammo box there, just like the crew is holding. And then that right there is one of those machine gun clips or is that the lid that might be the lid wait I thought I saw nope see on this side it looks like it's got an actual belt shells okay All right, guys, that was the Italian Army Support Group. Radioman, medic, officer with a pistol, officer with a machine gun. You're looking at the mortar and the machine gun team. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, that looks like a short auto pistol. So that extra little piece that was sticking off is just extra flash. It's not a barrel. Okay, um, thanks for coming out and watching this, what's in the box. Be sure to stay tuned for more Italian uh, army uh, boxes. And uh, at the very end of this series, 
you should be able to see uh, these fully painted as part of a uh, a demonstration for you of what it looks like at the end. All right, I'll see you in the next video.